Hi guys. Um, so you are going to be reading, actually you're going to be listening to a book called Tops and Bottoms. Um, this is going to be a trickster tale, which is a folk tale. So you are going to be thinking about the lesson that our character might have learned. In this book, Tops and Bottoms, it refers to vegetables. Every vegetable has a top and every vegetable has a bottom. For example, you notice right on the cover here that there is a carrot. Carrots grow underground. This is the bottom of the carrot and the top of the carrot is actually covered by this metal here. The top of the carrot is just kind of like green and leafy and we don't really eat them. This is another example of a top and bottom. This is a lettuce plant. Lettuce um, on the top is nice green and leafy and then on the bottom is just kind of roots. The last one that you're going to notice is this corn over here. Corn grows on stalks and the stalk is, we don't use it to eat, but the corn is grown in the middle of the stalk. Um, and the hair, you're going to notice, is our trickster. So we're going to think about how does this bear learn a lesson. Now, this bear is going to be wealthy. Wealthy means that he has a lot of money. And in this book, you're going to notice that the hare doesn't have much money. And he doesn't have money because he lost a risky bet. And the bet actually was with a tortoise. And this might be something that you have heard before, a story called The Tortoise and the Hare. And the hare lost in that story. Um, what you're going to notice is that this hare is going to be clever and trick the bear um, to pay off his debt, which is something he lost in a different story, The Tortoise and the Hare. And what's going to happen is you're going to notice that the hare is going to get tricky with the bear, and you're going to be thinking about how is he tricking the bear, and is the bear ever going to not be tricked by this hare? Um, throughout the story, they're going to harvest the vegetables. Harvest means that they are going to pick all the vegetables when they are ready. So when everything's ready, they're going to harvest and they're going to wake up bear and they're going to say, all right, bear, here's what you wanted. And I'm looking at bear and I'm noticing mm, maybe this isn't what he wanted. So what I want us to do is I want us to listen to, um, this book being read by a different teacher entirely, but it, the words that she says are going to highlight on your screen in yellow, and it will be on YouTube. Once you finish listening to the whole story, I want you to answer the question on Class Dojo. You need to make sure you're using complete sentences and punctuation. Please make sure you are answering the whole question, and you're reading the question so that you're answering the question. Don't make up your own question, please. All right, I'll see you guys later.